I welcome you warmly on our channel. I'm very happy you are here, especially today on our second live stream. My name is Janusz Lisowski and you can find me on Liches and chess.com under the username Janek86. Along with me today we can meet also uh, Kinga and Lech. Of course uh, there are more people participating in the project. They are mainly specialists of mobile app development and C language. Today we would like to tell you something about uh, the project, uh, what prompted us to do it, main features and the timeline. Uh, then we will show you a few versions of uh, IHS1, XY, uh, SSI and the current one. We would like uh, to show you our social media profiles and play one or two uh, rapid games on uh, liches.org. Uh, I think uh, 10 minutes without any increment. Uh, close to the end of the stream we will make a Q&A session uh, but you can uh, write uh, your questions on uh, the chat during the whole stream as well. Uh, we will try to answer them immediately. I just one has been created uh, to solve the following problems. Lack of an opponent uh, on a similar level, lack of signaling uh, and synchronizing, weak mobility, disrupted uh, perspective, uh, and uh, infection risk uh, due to the pandemic. I'm a huge uh, fan of playing chess over the board. Playing on the phone is uh, it's okay, but uh, I expected something more. When we play on the laptop, uh, mobile phone, or, or generally on the flat screen on, on our mobile uh, devices, our per perception uh, changes, uh, and that's why I don't really like it. Additionally, I also enjoy playing outside the home uh, with friends, but after uh, playing a few blitzes, I'm not able to analyze these games because I don't remember patterns or all game moves. I'm an electronic designer, uh, that's why I decide to make uh, my own uh, electronic chessboard. Here you can see a comparison of uh, IHS1 to other electronic chessboard and main features uh, on the left. As you can see, IHS1 is electronic, wooden, tournament side, has dedicated app, of course, uh, for Android and iOS, uh, can work without external controller. Besides, uh, IHS1 has multicolored RGB LEDs, uh, so it shines uh, in different colors, not only uh, monochrome red or white light uh, like other competitors. Uh, what's more, uh, only IHS1 is foldable and inside the case uh, there is space for all uh, the components and no worries about losing them. The IHS1 project officially began in late 2090, uh, when the first concept was created, but uh, the idea was born in my mind much, much earlier. As you can see on the screen, in 2020 we focused on research. Uh, here is, we created a sensor matrix and board controller. At the beginning of 2021 we started app development and uh, we absorbed the uh, first functional prototypes. After that we created more advanced versions such as uh, XY and SSI. Uh, which finally were combined into the current version. Now Lech will tell you something more about the differences uh, between version of the IHS1. Hello everyone. Uh, before I uh, will show you the gameplay on the final version of the IHS1, I would like to show you uh, and quickly discuss uh, its earlier versions. From the very beginning, we planned to, cre to create an ele electronic foldable chessboard that would have uh, the functionality of uh, ident identifying chess pieces, the possibility of online play and uh, a visual indication of opponent's movement. The first prototypes were created uh, to test uh, effectiveness of the, the identification of chess pieces with the use of a radio frequency identification system, RFID in short. For the implementation of this method uh, of ident identifying chess pieces uh, consists in creating of a matrix of uh, antennas hidden under the surface of the chessboard and a smaller individual antennas uh, installed uh, at the base of each chess piece. 
the first test uh, shown a good detection efficiency and minimal power consumption, but the game, but the time needed to read the text was too long uh, to allow for a blitz game. In order to increase the detection speed, we used uh, magnetic field detectors and placed a small magnet in each chess piece. Thanks to this, the delay is practically unnoticed and has no greater impact uh, on the game than internet conne connection delay or server response time. Another important uh, technical challenge was uh, the electrical connection of the two halves of the chessboard. Classic wooden foldable chessboard consists of the two halves connected to each other by two hinges. The hinges are made uh, of electrically conductive metal, so it's possible to use them to transmit uh, the power supply current. However, the power supply is not enough because we need the two-way uh, data exchange between two, uh, the halves in order to read the situation on the board and to indicate the opponent's movement. The first idea was to use spring uh, connectors called pogo pins which ensured a good electrical connection. You can see it here. And uh, uh, this is uh, two halves and uh, this is this uh, hinge. The first version of our chessboard was just uh, equipped with this type of connection. During tests and longer use, um, it turned out uh, that the pins are quite delicate and uh, due to their small dimensions, they require a great precision during assembly and a slight play on the hinges or dirty contacts may cause, uh, the prob uh, cause problems with the connection. Another issue was the way uh, to power uh, the board, which should be reliable and safe. Our cho choice was m a magnetic connector that can be connected without looking and also makes it practically uh, impossible to overturn the board and scatter chess pieces by jerking the cord. Uh, the first complete chessboard was equipped with an opponent's movement uh, indication system based on LED diodes hidden under the chessboard surface. Uh, this is our unique method of identification by highlighting the outer edges of the board uh, that uh, corresponds to rows or numbers, uh, col columns, uh, letters. Uh, we named this version XY. This version of the chessboard was featured in our first Kickstarter crowdfunding campaign. At the same time, we worked uh, on an alternative version with individual illumination of each field. We called it SSI, single square indication. Uh, in this version, each field contained uh, four lines at the corners of uh, each field. Uh, and due to the very strong absorption of light uh, by dark wood, special diffusers uh, made of milky plastic were used. The lighting effects was, uh, effect was very visible. Unfortunately, making such a version was extremely time consuming. This modification made the uh, chessboard look no longer classic and its surface wasn't perfectly even. Here is the uh, rendering uh, showed uh, the, uh, the way of, of, of lighting. And uh, here you, you, were be, uh, you were able to see the, these small diffusers. After the campaign on Kickstarter and uh, consultations with chess players, we decided to combine the advantages of uh, both versions while eliminating uh, the problems uh, arising from the production technology of, S the, of the SSI version. In the new concept, four lines have been replaced with two points located at uh, the, uh, the side edges of each field. Thanks to this, we greatly reduced the number of LEDs which allowed us to use RGB LEDs, the color and intensity of which can be freely adjusted. In order to, for the chessboard to retain its classical look, all LEDs are hidden under the surface, and the wood in the place of luminous point is precisely hollowed out using our um, proprietary CNC technology. We also uh, decided to leave all LEDs located on uh, the edges of the board 
that were originally in the XY version. Uh, and the user will be able to decide which method uh, will suit him the best and will be able to switch it anytime. For example, different people in one family use the chessboard. Uh, they will be able to set their individual preferences uh, in the application. And here you can see uh, our final, um, final prototype uh, with dedicated uh, insert with the wooden uh, stand for uh, smartphone, also with this special ma magnetic connector ended with a USB plug. And here is uh, this uh, board with, uh, with, uh, with the metrics. And now uh, our uh, social media. Uh... Here uh, is our website. When you enter www.ichess.one, it will direct you to our uh, website where you can find much information about the iChess One, the first in the world electronic chessboard that can be folded. Here you can find some information. This is a patent pending wooden e-board, tournament sides with stout on five pieces. All components are placed inside the chessboard. These uh, are not only 32 standard pieces, but also two extra queens. A mobile phone stand, a USB cable to connect our e-board with a power bank and a pen. It's already integrated with Liches Org, but uh, we are also uh, going to integrate it with another servers such as Chesscom and others. Our app is compatible with uh, iOS and Android. What's really cool, we have piece recognition so the chessboard detects incorrect position, incorrect move and signals it via red light indication. Note that chessboard looks like a classic one, but it's, it's actually an electronic one. Look at the surface. The LEDs are located under the surface of the chessboard, throughout which light appears only when they receive the message to light up. And another cool thing, if you like to play chess in the pub or outdoors, you can take this e-board with you because it's easy to take away, it's foldable and it's really quick and easy to start. You can play wherever you want and then go back to the gameplay, analyze it technically on any chess program because you can generate a PGN file. When we go back to the top of the page or when we click just in here, join to the uh, waiting list, it will direct you to the bottom of the website. Here, you need to enter your email address and click I want my iChess One. When you do that, please don't forget to check your email and confirm that it's correct. By doing so, you will be added to our waiting list and you will be kept up to date with iChess One and of course when we launch on Kickstarter. But uh, if you really want to stay up to date, follow us on our social media. And here you have our Facebook uh, fan page uh, where we will be uploading posts from the world of chess, some trivia, puzzles and others. Here is our Facebook insiders group. By joining to iChess One Insiders, you can also add some posts uh, and uh, you can have a real impact on iChess One development. You can ask questions, uh, you can uh, get advice. Here we will be also posting updates for the upcoming Kickstarter campaign. Uh, we also would like to invite you to our Instagram profile where we are going to run some giveaways. Lately, there was a contest where you could win free lessons with FIDE Master with Victor from Tricks of Chess. 
We are planning uh, more competitions in the near future. If you have an idea for any, let us know on I Just One Insiders group. You are also welcome to join our Twitter, our LinkedIn, and of course also YouTube channel, where we will be posting uh, gameplay movies and others. Here you can find some old movies explaining how the previous version of uh, I Just One worked. In the near future, we will add uh, a new uh, video on how the current version works. Here you can also see our teaser. Let's look at it. Open. Deploy. And immerse. Attack, check, and mate. The first foldable electronic chessboard to play anywhere, anytime, and with anyone in the world. Master your moves with a tournament standard, hand carved wooden set, and feel the real beauty of chess. Like you see, soon we'll uh, go to the Kickstarter. So if you like I just won and uh, want to back us, want to support us, you can go directly to the Kickstarter and click notify me on lunch. Uh, you can find uh, the link to the Kickstarter also here uh, on our insiders group. The first lucky ones will be able to purchase the chessboard at an early bird price. The rest will also be able to buy at a special price, a little bit higher than uh, the early bird price, but also much lower than the post campaign sale price. Notice that the single set includes I just one chessboard, 32 uh, Stoughton 5 wooden pieces, two extra queens, USB cable, mobile phone stand, a pen, and one year warranty. And another uh, thing is that if you want to join our beta testers, you can join them using following link, uh, which you can find on ITS1 Insiders group. Remember that filling the survey doesn't mean that you will join the group of testers. All surveys will be verified and we will choose five people and contact them closer to the shipment date. Those of you who have already completed the application form don't have to do it once again because we already have it. Okay, so now let's move to the gameplay. Now we can play. Uh, so maybe w uh, somebody want to uh, in invite me on the rapid game. I'm Here ready. you have uh, the account on the chess. This is I just one test. I just one test. Okay, maybe I uh, show you how we can uh, uh, back to the uh, ready game. So uh, now we have uh, the uh, start position, but I have, uh, as you can see uh, on, on my screen from, from mobile phone, I have uh, open uh, games uh, with uh, Stockfish. So when I press the button, I have the situation on, on the board. Uh, uh, many red lights, so I have to change the position of uh, of the pieces. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, so let's just continue. Okay. Move, move, move. Mobile phone. Oh, this is 
Got the information that uh, I play uh, from the black side. The information because uh, the black side uh, shines uh, in green. green. Yes. Yes. So you can see the gang removed from the edition. Uh, sorry, knight. And now uh, the stop switch also will be fixed. Okay. I. Keep the green light off. Ah, this one. Oh, we are not playing this one. After we place uh, the uh, pieces on the correct place, uh, then uh, green light uh, turn off uh, automatically. The green light shows us where the piece should be transferred when uh, the piece is mm, illuminated in red light that means that it uh, should be transferred into another position and this uh, different position is uh, signaled by green light of course uh, these are uh, full color uh, LEDs so it will be possible to, to change the color for uh, some from for the uh, let's say blue for violet yeah but uh, red and uh, green are the most uh, intuitive uh, colors yes if red that means that something uh, should be moved if green this is the place where it should be located true <laughs> <laughs> Okay, I got the information that I black one, I kill the green light, I put indication that who, who will do this. Okay. Currently we can play on uh, liches.org, um, but uh, we are also going to implement it uh, on uh, chesscom and another servers here is our profile i just want test on leeches so if you want you can challenge us rapid game 10 minutes and uh, you will see i just want in action So here is our profile, 
Lichess uh, profile. I just want test. If you want, if you want challenges, go ahead. Together with uh, I just want, uh, you will get our application. Uh, it's uh, for iOS and Android and it will be constantly updated. So when new features uh, occur, you will have it. Okay, I will start the uh, game with the random uh, opponent. see uh, the change from Bali Casual to Miss. Okay, so I will just stand this game. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, just before you uh, will break it, uh, can you show us uh, what will uh, happen if you play to uh, one position because you only have to, uh, one position? Or maybe it will be in the next game? Yeah, in the game. Okay. Oh, but I see no challenges. Um, <laughs> too late. Uh, ca can you challenge us uh, once again, please? Because we just uh, stopped oh, our. Okay. Yes, yes, we have. Oh, great. Okay, so right now I just want is uh, white because uh, the lights uh, shine in green. So I can show you how and both inform us about the uh, the wrong position, the wrong move. But I make it a little. So when you place the piece in incorrect position, uh, the chessboard signals it um, by red light mm -hmm. indication. And then you have to move the piece in the correct position. Yeah. They may be casting, now uh, the boys inform us uh, uh, rooking. very fast response time. <laughs> 
we work uh, we we were working on it to make it really fast and uh, will be even faster on the board we have information uh, about late communication and we have to put it in the same position when we It also means that uh, when you drop uh, some piece, uh, it will indicate red light, yeah? Mm -hmm. But then uh, you can place it in the correct position and everything will be okay. You don't believe it works to go good? <laughs> too good to be true. <laughs> too good to be true. <laughs> see, you can see this is real time. Yes, exactly. It's real time, but. Uh, of course it can uh, work even faster because we have here uh, the delay uh, because of the uh, internet connection. Yeah? And as you see, the chessboard looks like a classic one because uh, you don't see uh, the LEDs. They are hidden under the surface and they light up only when they get information uh, that they have to light up. <laughs> So if uh, mm, 
this can be improved, the Blitz game becomes real. Yes, it is. Uh, it already is real. Yeah, Janusz, can you yes, explain? Yes, uh, uh, port is uh, ready for faster game, but uh, this is a limitation by, by uh, glitches. That's, uh, this is uh, due to um, the, the limitation uh, to um, due to the cheater reasons. Uh, that means that um, if you challenge uh, your colleague, somebody that you know, you can play Blitz. Uh, but uh, you cannot uh, play Blitz with uh, someone unknown uh, due to the, um, the, the this uh, policy, uh, policy of uh, uh, cheater avoidance. We also like the wooden board uh, because it because it is real. <laughs> <laughs> it, it's wooden in, in reality, and uh, I can tell you that uh, if the lights goes off, uh, that uh, you can you you can't uh, uh, see if it is uh, electronics or the classical one. There is absolutely no uh, any sign uh, of uh, of these uh, LEDs. Mm -hmm. And that was our goal, mm -hmm. to make electronic one, which looks like a classic one. Yes, uh, after the game, uh, I can show you uh, our uh, SSI version, uh, which is also very nice, but uh, uh, I can show you uh, la later on. Are you also planning a version without coordinates? Yes, uh, we want to uh, to offer uh, that version As in well. the future. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Right now, we are focused on um, finishing. I just won, um, and um, we want to go to the Kickstarter. What a game! <laughs> I think it's the last chance uh, to offer Brawl. <laughs> <laughs> Can you <Let's> share? Try. <laughs> <laughs> Can you share prize for your board? Uh, the early bird prize, um, which will be available for approximately one day. Um, will be 379 euro and then the special price uh, will be 399 euro with the breakaway cable nice design by the way would it uh, reconnect uh, to the game right away after uh, regaining power? Could, could you show yeah. it? Yeah, can you show it? When you reconnect uh, the power supply, the mm, uh, cable? This feature is not, not ready yet, so I can't uh, show it uh, at this moment, uh, but we, we are working on it. It is possible. Technic te technically, it is possible. We, uh, we, we have uh, and uh, already made it, but uh, we, we must uh, pol polish it a bit. That's why uh, we are still working on it. Uh, and um, we need to finish those issues and then we'll go to the Kickstarter. Light. 
black one and by like this shape. Mm -hmm. Okay, so that was the game. Can you hear us? Sounds wrong. Uh, yes, now yes. Okay, okay, great. I can I can show you the cable. It's just one meter. One meter, so but mm -hmm. uh, we also designed the special uh, uh, smartphone stand that, that, that we can wind uh, the cable to be the one piece of ac ac accessory and we can put it uh, inside the, uh, the, uh, the insert. Maybe I can place it here. Hmm. Okay, yeah. doesn't matter. Uh, it's <laughs> it's smart. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, yeah and it's uh, really quick and easy to to start because you just uh, need uh, our the, the chessboard. Uh, you need uh, this cable that uh, is uh, inside, um, and you need to, to uh, connect it with uh, some external uh, power supply. Uh, sours, for example, power bank, and that's it. Our app, and you can play. Very nice job on the board. I'm excited for you guys uh, to on the release day. I feel emotionally oh, great. <laughs> can I use electrical con uh, contact on uh, or only power banks? No, no. Uh, the power consumption uh, is uh, very low, so you so you are able because it is. Uh, the uh, magnetic connector is only uh, on, on the chessboard side, but uh, th uh, the other end of the cable is standard USB. So you can connect it to the power bar bank or uh, to the laptop com computer, uh, to the to phone, your charger, phone, to, to your charger uh, exactly. So there is no uh, lim limitation because it is compatible with, uh, with this first uh, USB standard. We don't uh, want to tell uh, today about uh, the date, uh, but we, we know when we can place <laughs> this project on, on Kickstarter. It's nearly soon, soon because we, we have to, uh, to solve uh, some cases on the board and uh, then we are practically ready to, to, to place it. Chess pawn, chess pawn is our first goal, and uh, mm, maybe we add uh, USB uh, to the board, USB C. Thank you. We are happy that you like it. <laughs> okay. Okay. So, thank you for being with us today. Yes, it's our plan to make uh, different types uh, because uh, it has uh, it is quite un universal technique and uh, we can just uh, stick this uh, NFC tags uh, underneath the chess piece so so we can uh, use uh, any kind of chess pieces uh, but we also uh, later on uh, design our own chess pieces by more modern one let's say but right now we want to make a classic line. Uh, so right now these are stout on five pieces, the classic one. As a standard. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So thank you very much for being with us. Stay tuned. Follow us on our social media and hopefully see you soon. Yes. Thank you. Bye. -bye. Bye. Bye. Thank you.